All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for your phone calls. And, uh, of course, 877 Newsmax, that's the number. And let's go uh, first to Belleville, Texas, and say hello to Bonnie. Hi, Bonnie. Hi, Steve. I'm Hi. here. Well, thank you for participating. What's up today? Well, I just am still happy about Trump winning in New York. I think he's the only one that's not a globalist, because the rest of them, I, now I know what he's talking about when he keeps saying, Lion Ted, yeah, do the research. All the research that I've been finding, if you check out what he Heidi and Ted have been up to, Heidi has been in the CFR, Council of Foreign Relations. Right. She's been working for world government. They're globalists. They want the new world order, and they're pushing it. All right, but Bonnie, let me, let me ask you this. If Cruz is the nominee, you will vote for Cruz over Hillary, right? Uh, it's all the same. They're all the no, same. No, 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 no. Bonnie, Bonnie you, can't, Bonnie, Bonnie, you can't believe that, that, that the Supreme Court would look the same and the result to your children and grandchildren would be the same if a Hillary Supreme Court is appointed or a Cruz Supreme Court is appointed. You can't believe that would be Maybe the same. Maybe not as quick. Maybe no, no, no. Look, quick. look. You, well, don't, Bonnie, don't get caught up in that because otherwise we'll have no First Amendment, we'll have no Second Amendment, we'll have affirmative action forever, we'll have abortion on demand forever, we'll have everything that you abhor we will have uh, in the next few years if Hillary gets to appoint those justices. I'm telling you, you could despise Cruz now, you could despise Trump now, you could despise Kasich, but when push comes to shove, they're all better than Hillary. Just re please remember that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because I've read the Clinton Chronicles. You can Google the Clinton <laughs> oh, Chronicles. Oh, I don't have to Google them. They're all up here in my head. Uh, Bonnie, thank you very much. I really appreciate it as always. Let's go now to upstate New York. And uh, let me look up. Yep, there it is. And say hello to Kathleen. Hello, Kathleen. Hi, Steve. First, I just want to thank you so much. Um, I respect your integrity. Um, it, it's really remarkable in this day and age. Thank you. I appreciate that. Um, my first comment is that um, we are here in northern New York. We are very thrilled that Mr. Trump won New York. Um, we're, we're glad to see the, the common sense, and maybe there will be some hope for our country's future. Um, my next comment, I'm, I'm just kind of waiting to see if Bernie is going to return to his independent roots and run as a third-party candidate. Um, I think his supporters would appreciate not having to go over and vote for Clinton. And, and who's this? Who'd you say? If, if Bernie oh, oh, oh. would run as, go well, back to his independent roots. I doubt that he would do it because he's not a boat rocker. He hasn't brought up her emails. He hasn't brought up anything about the Clinton Foundation. He's staying away from any, you know, she's running as the champion of women. He's not mentioning the women that accuse her of things. So uh, he, I, I guarantee, I could guarantee you as much as I could guarantee anything, uh, he won't go there. He just won't. I, I think that certainly would help the Republican Oh, Party yeah, absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. So keep praying for it, Kathleen. Will do. All right, okay. thank you very much. Have a great day, uh, night. Uh, Sadie from Rancho Cucamonga, California. Did I say it right, Sadie? Uh, that is correct. There you Thank go. You. Thank you. What can I do for you? Well, I'm just uh, calling to, uh, I support Cruz. Okay. I believe that he would be excellent as our new president. And uh, I don't like Trump. He has no knowledge of anything except himself. Okay, and well, let me also, ask you this. Go ahead. Also what? Uh, also, uh, people have to learn about history to know what's happening now. Well, and, you don't want to repeat uh, it. it. You it, don't want to repeat it. Absolutely. Sad. But let me ask you that. Let me let me say the same. Ask you or tell you or, or the same thing that I told uh, Bonnie. I think it was. Uh, are you willing, if, if Trump is the nominee, to vote for him as opposed to Hillary? As a Republican, I have to. Good. Or, good. Or That's either uh, that or write in. No, no, no. Yeah, let, Sadie, if you write in anybody then you're voting for Hillary we cannot oh, allow okay. well, Hillary yeah please because the... yeah because you can't you can't let her stack that Supreme Court or we're done as a country as we know ourselves thank you Sadie please call again all right folks up next Thursday must be Malsberg's media madness with Tim Graham don't go away <laughs>